first we start by creating our sheet mod models in the file and then I'd have to manually number each one under the sheet number field and give them a sheet name with our sheets numbered we now have four sheets in this file we would come in and in our cell or our title block if we were using a seed file we would use a text field so uh, here we would insert field and we would use the model properties and so in our model properties we'll go to our sheet and we'll go to sheet number and say OK and we'll number our sheet. Now we could put uh, also um, we'll create another text field for title and this time we'll come in here to our sheet sheet number and we'll go to sheet name and we'll make this a bit smaller okay. and then uh, from here uh, we can actually I believe we can copy these and place them in our other sheets now these would be set up in a cell So in our text toolbar, we have an update annotation. So we can simply move into each model. And actually, just by moving through, they update. OK, so now we want to um, go in and open up Project Explorer. And Project Explorer, we need to create a new link set so this could be a configured library uh, but more than likely it's going to be a, a new link set so we're going to actually what we want is the active file so we want to set up a new link set in the active file we say new and we give it a name and Say OK. So with that in place, uh, we can close out and make sure we're in here for project sheets. So now we want to link to a project folder. So we have to go in here, and go to our drive, and we'll just select the entire folder with all my projects. And then what I want to do is I want to grab my sheets and place them into a sheet file or a folder that I'll create. So what we'll do is we'll come into um, then here and I'll find my topo sheets and I'm going to select the sheet models. I'm going to uh, copy then I'll go into the sheet number folder that I created here by going to new folder and I'll paste okay so here I can now renumber these sheets so depending on the order that they're in if I move topo x up and we'll go um, we'll just start with topo x then we'll go to topo topo proposed and proposed to and then we'll come in here and we'll just say renumber and we'll start uh, at 100 or let's say 10 and we'll increment by 1 and so now um, if we go into the sheet models starting with um, topo X or topo existing we'll see my sheet numbers are updated